Let's go out. Don't speak. Don't speak. Don't make a sound. Okay. I beat my record. You are out. <sighs> you know that if brain doesn't get fresh oxygen for three minutes, you're dead. Forget something? Or you can end up you know, paralyzed. Aren't you Brain in damage. the undergraduate journalism program? I haven't seen you in a while. Uh, yeah. I haven't been coming to lectures much. Mm. Not really feeling it. Oh. Right. So oh, look, that thing you were doing in the water. Can I ask what it's about? Holding your breath like that? Some people meditate. I sink to the bottom of the pool. One of these days I'm gonna get to two minutes. Wow, that sounds intense. Why do you do it? I'm challenging myself. It's nothing. Just beating the clock. You don't want to just try out for the swim team or something? I don't do teams. I should be getting home. Look, it's just... So, I had a friend in middle school. She was, like, infuriatingly perfect. Top of the class, captain of the soccer team. And one day, we're all on this field trip, and boom, she disappears. Gone. We then... I just know she'd have felt better if she knew there was someone ready to listen. No. Hmm, I'm not interested. Look, I know you're just trying to help, but this really isn't... Sure, I get it. You can take it for later, maybe? Save a tree. Give it to someone who cares. Alright, maybe another time. What was the outcome? Um, what decision made that outcome, I wonder? Was it because we kept her instead of in the motel, instead of her mother, or...? Hmm. So, I talked to Mima. What? When we were changing the license plate, I called to check on her. Okay. Did you tell her any... No, no, I just wanted to hear her voice. she probably forget in two minutes. Could we go through the national Are park? Are you sure you're up for this? Huh? Hiking over the border? Okay. <laughs> I hate hiking. But, hey, guess it's time to be flexible. I'm gonna be a wanted criminal now. You're not a criminal. You're just helping a friend. Did you watch the OJ trial? The what? <laughs> OJ Simpson? All American football player accused of murdering his wife because she's screwing some waiter? I don't really watch TV. Huh. Well, the point is, nobody's what they seem, you know? Like, <sighs> what are we capable of? Are we all just killers waiting for our switches to get flipped? Doesn't work like that. What about kindness? You need some predisposition that, in order to right? be See? killer. The world needs more people like you. More on the manhunt for the Desert Dream killers who first robbed the Two Rock County Sheriff's house, then took shelter at a motel that turned into the scene of a. Wait, was that you? Yeah, but I don't want to hear. 
I do. Describe Jay Holt as an awkward, quiet high school dropout. Ugh, they say it like dropping out's a crime. Holt also has an accomplice, 16-year-old Vanessa Dorland, mm. who is assumed to be armed and dangerous. If you see either of these violent criminals, uh. please call 911 and make... Did he say awkward? Is it true? Am I oh, awkward? I thought you were gonna turn Life's that into awkward. joke. We're all awkward. But me especially, huh? In a good way. Okay, don't stress. We'll figure this out. Morning, you two. Everything okay, officer? Just running a sobriety checkpoint here, looking for any intoxicated drivers coming back from that River Palooza music festival. Were you there? No, sir. We're just passing through. Can I ask where you're coming from? Oh, San Francisco? We're from San Francisco. We're driving cross country. Strange route you're taking. You don't have California plates. Oh, it was his aunt's car. She lived here in Montana before she died. So we're here to visit his uncle. Mm hmm. Hmm. Uh huh. Anyway, if I could just see your license and registration, you'll be on your way. They're in the mail. They're still getting sent. I just went to the DMV. Didn't they give you provisionals? Oh, it's the DMV. What don't they screw up? <laughs> hey, my mom works at the DMV. <laughs> and you are so right. <laughs> I could just run the plates. <laughs> Dispatch, need you to run some plates for me. Montana, three, Papa, two, one, five, seven, Tango. Shit, he's gonna find out any second. What, again? Well, can't you run it manually? We need to get out of here. Wait. Look, I can explain. <sighs> Goddamn database is down again. Huh. There's a sneak peek of Y2K for you. All right, I'm gonna let you off with a warning. Next time, bring your license along for the ride. I will, officer. Go on, get out of here. Does it really work like that? In the USA? I honestly know, well, in Central Europe, I know no country where they would just leave you off like that. If you don't have your registration, your driving, driver's license, car's registration uh, documents. Oh. Really. Hey, Dad. How's the, um, new plane? Oh, you are gonna love it. So much quieter than the old one. Did so, they divorce? Um, are you okay? It was my birthday on Sunday, and you usually call. Oh, Dad. I'm sorry. It's just... The thing is, I... Don't tell me. Lectures coming out of your ears. <laughs> I get it. 
So, how about I drop by campus tomorrow for lunch? That might be... tricky. Why? Everything's cool at school, right? I might drop out. I'll drop to keep it. To be honest, Dad. Honest. I'm not sure the program's right for me. What are you saying? You're dropping out? You've been wanting to study journalism since the ninth grade. No, just... weighing my options, that's all. Zoe, your mom's gonna <sighs> flip. I know, but listen... You should call her. And then we need to discuss this together. Sorry. Uh, Dad, I gotta go. Who's that? In the bathroom. <sighs> now I can drawer. Let's search drawer. Why do you have your laptop on if you want? Huh? I think you're asleep, or at least your that? brain is asleep. I think I'm picking only the wrong options. there hmm. stay inside it's always easier to just close the door than ju than having to maneuver with the chain It's late, but I could use a friendly ear right now. Do you mind if I come over? Oh, uh, thing is, I, I, I've run into a little, uh, situation here. What kind of situation? Mr. Walker! I'll be there in ten. <sighs> it's like I told you, I can't have tenants damaging the building. And I told you, I didn't damage a damn thing. Uh -huh. Mr. Walker, I really don't want to get into another argument. Oh. Hey there, Zeusy, old boy. Zoe, thank God you're here. <sighs> now, please tell this woman I have a right to the quiet enjoyment of my own home. Huh. Quiet enjoyment? 
You vandalized your front door. Okay, slow down. What happened? Somebody broke in and stole my wallet. Uh, no. Hmm. You misplaced your wallet, and you broke your own front door. Zoe, someone was here. I saw him lurking in the shadows. What else did he take? Did he take anything else? Yes, my slippers. Oh, oh, of course. Give me a break. Your grandfather wandered outside in his robe for the third time this month. When he realized he didn't have his keys, he broke the door to get back in. That is not true. I wanted some air, so I, I took a walk and, uh, and I, I saw someone and, uh, I, and then the next thing I know, I'm arguing with, with Shelby here. That's not even my name. Yeah. Zoe, I know this is painful to hear, but your grandfather is declining. He needs That's a nurse possible. or an assisted living oh, home God or... Oh, goddammit, I don't need assisted anything. We obviously have very different interpretations of what happened. Still... Somebody will have to pay for that door. Insurance can pay. Don't you have some hmm. kind of insurance? It's his front door. He broke it. Huh? He pays for it. Oh, Jesus. Can you believe that woman? Assisted living. Maybe we can live together. She sounds just like your parents with that crap. Not that they ever speak to me. Don't tell Shelby. But I know I didn't break my door because I keep a spare key under the mat. You do? Isn't that kind of unsafe? You want to hide something where no one will find it? Stick it right under their noses. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. How are you doing, kiddo? Anything new? Me? I'm fine. You're oh, you don't look fine. So not fine. You look like you did back in high school when you thought you could cram for finals by staying up all night on triple lattes. How you been sleeping? Maybe nightmares. Didn't have a bad night for months. Until the nightmares started creeping back. Now, I'm scared to fall asleep. Oh, Zoe. You seem to be doing so well. Did something happen? It doesn't matter. Oh. Seriously. So, what else? Still got your sights on the New York Times? Actually, I'm thinking of leaving school for a while. I told Mom and Dad. You can imagine how that went down. Ooh, like the Titanic, I expect. I always thought it suited you, the investigative journalism thing. Digging around in other people's business, telling the world how it really is. I don't know, Grandpa. I just want to wake up on a beach somewhere. No one around. Walk out into the ocean. And disappear under the waves. No, you don't. Take it from someone who's been a pro at running away. Wherever you run, your problems run after you. <sighs> Hang on. Where's my tablet computery thing? Oh, no. Those bastards. I got that for my 74th. Mind if I look around a little? Maybe I can figure out who stole your stuff. Be my guest. Mm, okay, let's go for the show first. All books, medical books. Is this all from when you were a traveling salesman? Salesman? Yeah, you told me you used to. Wasn't that your job? Kid, back then you could say I was a jack of all trades. I think the only real job I ever had was convincing people I was someone else. <laughs> Uh, 
Let's try to TV stand now. Grandpa, are you taking your meds? I don't like them. They make me fussy. Please take them. Sure, but they wouldn't prescribe them if you didn't need them. You're gonna stand there until I take them, aren't you? Yep, please. For me. Oh, all right. <laughs> Grandpa? Are you sure you didn't break the door yourself? God. How can I be sure of something I can't remember? Have you never gone into a room, forgotten why you came in? Haven't you ever misplaced or lost something? You know I've lost plenty. I don't want to lose you too. Shelby's right. It's getting worse. Places, dates, the school I went to. It's like someone slowly packing my memories into boxes and none of them have labels on. Can you imagine how that feels? Terrible. Sounds awful. I can't even begin to. <sighs> you must think I made this whole damn mess up. Actually, someone's been following me too, I think. What? Earlier at the pool. And then tonight at my apartment, I, I thought I saw someone. But I don't know if it's even real. I feel like we're both losing our minds. Good God. Zoe, look. I know you went through hell as a kid. Seeing all the terrible, terrible things you saw. And I know you sometimes think it drove you half crazy. It has. Seriously. You don't need to remind me. I know I don't. But that's what I'm trying to say. Hmm? I don't think you are crazy at all. Because if you were, how could we both be seeing the same thing? Grandpa? Either we're both losing our marbles or... Or what? No. It's impossible. This lack of sleep isn't really I just want to not care. How do I do that? How do I make the past leave me alone when I keep seeing it everywhere I go? 
I guess you just need to stand up and face it. <sighs> Look it in the eye and see this thing for what it is. If the past talks to you, you listen. And when it's done, then maybe you'll be free. It is from Dre. Okay. How did he get her address? Well, I guess he could have used the phone book. I wish I had another layer on. It's gonna be beautiful once we get some altitude. What's the furthest you've ever hiked? I did the two rocks of two rock once. <laughs> Don't laugh, it was hard. Come on, we got a lot of ground to cover. You know, really? Leading the car like that? Tell you a secret? I've never left Arizona before. Tell me when I'm not about to collapse. I promise I'll care. Here. Come <sighs> You'd be going a lot faster without me. I'd be going nowhere without you. Uh, Give me your hands. Uh, teamwork. <sighs> I don't get it. I'm cold and wet. My legs hurt like I've been in double gym all week. And you're the energizer bunny, just going and going. How do you do it? Um, it's, ex it's experience, really. Been doing this all my life. You've been doing it since lunch. Okay. Yeah, true. I'll get the hang of it. Ugh. My god, it's even more beautiful than I imagined. Sometimes at home, around sunset, me and my mom used to walk out into the desert. And on a hot day, if there was enough haze, the sun would just bloom like a giant fireball on the horizon. Was it better than this? Just different company. Hey, you're bleeding. Shit. I didn't even feel this happen. Let me see. <laughs> there. That's better. Glad you know what you're doing. So, how do we get over the border? We're gonna have to swim. Won't what? it be cold? Freezing, probably. But it's good for you. Wakes you up. Way better than coffee. And what about your clothes? Get down! Uh. Vanessa? Are you there? What? It's me. It's Dad. How? Dad? What are you doing here? Do you know? Do you have any idea? Who you run away with? His name's Jay. I know all about what happened at the motel, and honestly, I don't care. Vanessa. This isn't right. How did he find us? If you know who he is, then you know he's a murderer. He killed cops, Vanessa. He's going to death row. You have no idea what you're talking about. I didn't do any of that. They got the story wrong. 
Look, I don't even care. I just want my daughter Yay. back. It's never happening, Dad. That part of my life is over. <sighs> She's not gonna turn on him. We stick with plan A. Jay Holt, you are under arrest on the authority of the FBI. I'll admit, you nearly gave us a slip. That ranger at the entry kiosk earned his paycheck today. Now I got a whole team of federal agents here, so this is where it ends, Jay. I'm not letting you people send me to die. I have a clear shot on the suspect. Really? Oh, okay, I thought he showed him clear sign. To shoot. Let's go! Come on! Go! Go! That's bad. Please don't make you fall. Okay, thank you. That's bad. That's very bad. What do we do now? Orders down there. Past the lake. We gotta jump. Off this? Vanessa, wait! Stay back, Dad. You jump, you die. You'll never make it. We might. You don't know. Vanessa, whatever you think about me, you were my little girl once. Slept on my chest, walked on my feet. When is the last time you said you loved me? I'll give you a clue. It was never. Okay. I'm bad at saying it. I'm bad at a lot. After your mom died, I didn't know how to. I'd say left, you kids would go right. The more I tried, the more you both hated me. And then Matt went off the rails, and I... I know you think I'm a monster, but I do love you, Vanessa. If you say we can survive this, then I believe you. But let's just do it, before I change my mind. You should say... Dump of other. He's right. You shouldn't jump. Why? Because you've got a life ahead of you, Vanessa. You can go to college, become a lawyer, or a, a marine biologist, or anything you want. Me? Even if I survive, they're gonna hunt me forever. You don't deserve that. You said you wanted me to come. I guess I changed my mind. Jump. Kids, jump! Was he shot? You did the right thing. I'm not saying it's gonna get any easier, but at least you're not. Shut up, Dad. There was no clear indication that he was shot. 
letters well in those letters um, your dad told me the news I'm worried about you call me you sure this is the spot it's not on the trail map I'm good thank you Okay, we're in Canada. Whoa, easy. Roosevelt, what's got into you? My God, Zoe. Hi, Jay. I wasn't even sure you got the letters. One a month, ever since March. You know you're still wanted by the FBI, right? How did you even find me? The post office. I had your P.O. box number, and they helped me with the rest. People are nice here. Yeah, they are. You look so different. I knew you'd grown up, but in my mind, you're still that scared little kid. Oh, you've changed too. A little bit, but still. You look older too. Huh. More than I expected. Well, 14 years outside will do that to you. Hey, come sit down. I got a chair on the patio. And I promise... You won't need that pepper spray. You're fast to trust him. We could admit. Nice view. I used to think so. I've seen it a lot. It's so strange that you're here. Thought about you and your family so much over the years. So you said. In your letters. I tried not to think about yours. I was doing pretty good at that. Until you started writing. <sighs> oh. I have a lot of questions. About your life and... Go for it. I don't have anywhere to be. New scar? I don't remember you having a scar before. Oh, I used to explore a lot in the early days. One time I came across a bear that I thought was hurt. Turns out she had just had cubs. Lesson learned. How's your family? Do you ever hear from your family? Nah. Ma left the country, I think. Don't know where. Tyler got away too. And that's it. It's just me now. Heard from Vanessa? What about that girl you ran away with? Vanessa? I look her up sometimes. She went to Juvenile Hall for a while. But she's a... Something with lawyers now. She turned out okay. That's good. You don't know that. Nobody can know if someone's okay. I guess you're right. Just... I hope she's happy. She deserves it. Ever been recognized? In all these years, you've never been recognized? I had some close calls in town. But you don't really know. You just feel people looking. So now I don't go far. Library, the market, that's about it. How did you survive the drum? You know, the world thought you were dead after you jumped off that cliff. I almost was. I must have blacked out when I hit the water. But I don't remember swimming to shore. So, why'd you come here, Zoe? 
You said you wanted to talk. I said I wanted you to write. But you came. In person. Why? I keep seeing your face. And my dreams. Out on the streets. And? And I knew if I didn't come look you in the eye... That you couldn't move on. If you want to talk about it, I might understand better than most. And I'm good at listening. I've been struggling. Let's go with the truth. That night, when you took me upstairs and the power went out. Do you remember? Of course. I was just as scared as you. You said, don't make a sound. And it's like, I've been holding my breath ever since. When all I really want to do is scream and scream and never stop. I was just trying to get you quiet. The cops were breaking in. I didn't want you to get hurt. I know. I didn't say it made sense. You know what the two of us have in common? We both got dealt a shitty hand and spent the rest of our lives trying not to fold. You and me, we're a lot alike. Maybe we are. Maybe in some ways. Jay, why, why'd you start writing me? I told you, there's a lot I never got to talk about. I know, but why me? You said you see my face at night. Sometimes I see yours too. All these years later, you'd think I'd be able to move on, but I never have. You must hate me after everything my family did to you. Well, he's not the cause. Jay, I won't lie. Seeing you isn't easy. Your family killed a lot of people. I've been afraid of this moment for a very long time. But... You also looked out for me that night. I can't pretend I don't remember that too. How can you be so forgiving? I don't know. Because you're kind. I really tried to make you you're a good person. You're a hard person to feel angry at, Jay. Maybe in my nightmares. But in real life, you're... You're just a guy. And I tried real hard to make you, you a good some guy. terrible things. Jay. Are you okay? I mean... Are you really okay? I always told myself I got dragged into it. That my family was just pushing me around. But what if I'm wrong? What if it's who I am? Do you think I'm bad? Am I... Am I broken? No, you're not. You Not gave bad. the scared little girl her stuffed owl back. No one bad and broken would have done that. You remember that? Of course. You shouldn't have been there. You were just a kid. So were you. Oh, I should get back down to the bus stop. Wait. I, I was going to make dinner soon. Do you want some? Jay, I, I don't know. It's rabbit, and it's beautiful here at sunset. Rabbit, huh? Ah, they're so good braised. Show you how if you like. I am kind of hungry. <laughs> the thing about shadows is, you can't escape them. You just learn to keep them behind you and look toward the light. Why are some of us able to grow and change?
even when clouds have blocked out the sun. Why do some of us find ways to endure? while others just wither on the vine. I don't know the answers, but I know I'm done running from shadows. Nobody's chasing me. Nobody ever was. I did not expect that. So the stalker is real and I believe it will be book to expansion and I if I remember correctly there's still two more chapters left to go. So honor, values, integrity and doing what's right. Trusting believes in the good intentions of others and quick finger made decision without hesitation. I hesitate a lot, okay? Let's see. Ooh! Walker survived the desert dream. Walkers. Yep. Wait, then that spoke about future events. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Um, anything else that got strange? Ooh! Left Vanessa behind at falls. Visit J in Ka Okay, that's interesting. If we took Vanessa with us, then that she would have visited? That's interesting. Um, Jay's fate, you remain in Canada, Vince and Michelle's fate, Vince opened flight school, Michelle recovered from injury, she got engaged with Craig, Tyler became fugitive, and Sharon escaped country of pool. Hmm. That, that I didn't know about that. And apparently li leaving Vanessa is really a common choice. We entered. Oh well. Okay, but that's gonna be it for today. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!